Hi, I'm Mr. O Ming Yo. Okay, now let's talk about the internal energies of particles in an object. Okay, um, the internal energy that uh, is possessed by the particles in an object basically consists of kinetic energy and potential energy. So what is kinetic energy? Kinetic energy is basically due to the rate of movement or vibration of the particles. So the more kinetic energy the particles have, the higher the temperature of the object. Okay, now let's move on to potential energy. Potential energy is associated with the distance between the particles. So if there is an increase in potential energy, that means the object must undergo a change in state and in a way such that the particles are now uh, separated further apart. So the potential energy of particles can be seen to be similar to the elastic potential energy of a rubber band. As we stretch the rubber band, the rubber band will have more elastic potential energy. So in this case, as we as we try to separate the the particles, we try to move them further away, the more potential energy they will possess. Okay, so in short, the kinetic energy and the potential energy will make up the total internal energy of the particles.